Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Bonnie Gosson. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, April 15, 2021. Let's go to Randy to see what's happening today in history. Thank you, Bonnie. Today in history on April 15, 2010, President Barack Obama has said that it's likely that astronauts will be sent to orbit Mars by the mid-2030s. The president made the claim in major speech to staff and guests at the Kennedy Space Center, where he outlined the details of his new policies on space exploration. Obama said that he has given NASA some challenging goals and the funding to achieve them. This will include an extra $6 billion over the next five years. Now let's go to Scott for the sports highlights. Thank you, Randy. Today's sports highlights are brought to you by the Patriots. The world's strongest man is an international competition held every year, and the current strongest man in the world is Ukrainian Alexei Novikov. At only 24, he became the youngest man to ever hold the title after his win right here in Florida last November. It is not only strength that decides who is stronger, but your physiological and moral state, your level of training, ability to adapt, resistance to external stimuli, and technique, among other things. The competition has 10 events held over four days, and Alexei set a new record when he won by lifting a 1,185-pound bar. To put this into context, he weighs only about 300 pounds. Now let's go to Onalicia for the lunch report. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch is crunchy chicken tenders, baked beans, baby carrots, ranch dressing, fresh apples, barbecue sauce, and milk. Bon appetit! Now let's go back to Bonnie. Thank you, Noah. Patriots, this yearbook is currently on sale. Get your yearbook today for just $30. All yearbook purchases must be made through myschoolbooks.com. Scholars, this month will show that we are FSA ready. Every day we will have an activity that is FSA related. Today is Dress Like a Brainiac Day. It's a day where you show off your smartest look. Teachers, continue to share any interesting pictures with us on the RPTV OneDrive or email us at pines.renaissance at gmail.com. And finally, if you haven't already viewed the latest Path the Patriot virtual read aloud, it is airing now and it's up on our YouTube channel. Teachers, join in with your student to enjoy this month's story. Earth Day, every day. Read by our own very own Miss Tolentino. Thank you, Vani. Today's weather in Pemptine, Florida is forecast to be 87 degrees Fahrenheit and sunny. Looks like another sunny day. So get those sunglasses out. Now let's go to Samuel for the joke of the day. Thank you, Dee. And here's today's joke of the day. Two windmills are standing on a farm. One turns to the other and says, What's your favorite type of music? The other turns to him Big metal fan. Now let's go to Sonya for today's birthday. Thanks, Samuel. That was super funny. Today's birthday girls are Lauren Golden and Amaya Saunders. Happy birthday! Let's go back to Bonnie. Thank you, Sonia. Patriots, don't forget your past expectations are presents. Present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. Congrats to Miss Maynan, Miss Velez, Miss Kane, Mr. Benelia, Miss Hendrickson, Miss Moraz, Miss Julian, Miss Newton, Miss Ward, Miss Yearwood, Miss Santi Esteban, Miss Ian Dinkwa, and Miss Barrow. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's riddle, which was there is one word in the dictionary that is spelt wrong. What is it? The correct answer to the riddle was the word wrong. Now for today's riddle. A man dies of old age on his twenty fifth birthday. How is that possible? Again, a man dies of old age on his 25th birthday. How is this possible? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Winners will be announced the following day. 
Everyone at RPTV would like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday, and don't forget, remember, reunite, rise. Have a great day!